Richard Branson was born on July 18, 1950, in Blackheath, London. Richard struggled with dyslexia from childhood and had to struggle with educational institutions, so he was academically poor. Having no interest in studies but desiring to become an entrepreneur at a young age, Richard eventually dropped out of school at age 16 after he concluded the school was not where he wanted to be. On his last day at school, Richard was told by his headmaster, Robert Drayson, that he, Richard, would either end up in prison or become a millionaire. What a frustrating farewell statement. Richard attempted to grow and sell both Christmas trees and Budgerigas in England, but he failed. Instead, he launched a youth culture magazine named Student in 1966, though the first issue was published later due to some frustrating factors. The first 50,000 copies of his magazine were disseminated for free, but subsequent copies of the first issue earned him almost $8,000. Richard gradually rose to success as his net worth rose to about £50,000 in 1967. In 1969, Richard found himself within a community surrounded by the drug scene and British music. This influenced Richard into launching his mail-order record business in Oxford Street, London, England. He intended to use the fund from the business to promote his magazine efforts. Richard interviewed some famous personalities of the late 1960s and advertised popular records in his magazine. This brought Richard an overnight success. However, Richard was arrested in 1971 and charged for selling records in his store that had already been declared export stock. And it was so early in his business days, there was no way Richard could repay the debts and the charges led to his mother having to remortgage the family home. When Richard was in his late 20s, he got stuck in Puerto Rico, trying to get a flight to the British Virgin Islands to visit his then girlfriend as the flights was cancelled last minute due to lack of passengers. Richard was desperate to travel and his last chance was to chatter a plane, but he had no money on him. An idea came to him. He picked up a small blackboard and wrote, Virgin Airlines, $39 one way to BVI on it. He sold the tickets to the people who wanted to go to the Virgin Islands. Not only did he get the money to pay for the chattered plane, but that was also the birth of his Virgin Airlines and the rest is history. Today, Sir Richard has an estimated net worth of $4.1 billion. For young Richard Bradson, dyslexia was a big obstacle and he could have ended his life struggling to fit into the academic world as having a degree is a god in our present world. Many of life's struggles is as a result of fish trying to fly. As Albert Einstein allegedly said, everybody is a genius. But if you judge a fish by its ability to climb a tree, it will live its whole life believing that it was stupid. Most of us can do great stuff with our lives, but if we are operating in a world where our strengths cannot shine, we're fish trying to fly. So, the first step toward overcoming life's obstacles is to know who you are and where you belong. Another big lesson we can all learn from Richard Branson is that life isn't straight. Even if you're a bird, flying would still not be easy at first. You'll have to train your feathers, try flying, and fall many times. This is because every great thing takes time. Just as Warren Buffett said, you can have a baby next month by impregnating nine women today. While some of us need to stop trying to swim as fish, others just need to learn how to patiently endure the pains that come with learning how to swim. Richard Branson decided to quit school because he could never be a great student. You have to know where you belong and choose your fight according to your strengths. Branson went through several failures trying to build a business. Most times, all you have to do to overcome obstacles is to hang in there. Just as Roy T. Burnett said, your hardest times often lead to the greatest moments of your life. Keep going. Tough situations build strong people in the end. If you like this video, do subscribe to this channel so you'll be notified when we publish our next videos. Also, like this video or share it with your friends on social media. Thank you. We love you.